Yes, you can see me clearly here. Look, I have on my YouTube channel, no, not YouTube channel, on my Facebook profiles, two of them, I placed this video about um, Korean potter, potters. And they, there are about five potters, and in the video, each of them takes a lump of clay. No worry. And um, these potters, each of them took a large lump of clay and they began to make vessels, okay? And there was one vessel, one artist that took a vessel, he made, I mean, he took the clay, he made a vessel of it, and then he began to make holes in the vessel. And when he did that, I was shocked. I was thinking, what are you doing? You're ruining the whole vessel. What are you doing, putting, making holes in the vessel? I mean, if you put water or wine in it, you see, it's going to pour out. But I kept watching the video and later you could see that the vessel wasn't, it wasn't meant to carry water nor wine. It was meant to have a light in it. And because there was a light in the vessel when it was finished, the light was shining and through those holes it appeared it through by the, through those holes the light would come out and the room would be decor had would have a decorating light however when he was making the vessel I, I was thinking he's making a mistake he's ruining the whole thing however I didn't I didn't know the purpose of that vessel so I so my judgment was misplaced See, and that's what often happens in our daily lives also. We make judgments. I'm not saying we shouldn't make any judgments. But the judgments we make are often misplaced. Because we are not aware of the purposes that the Lord has with our trials. And sometimes we can easily misjudge others because we don't know the purpose Christ has for them. So what I'm telling you is just... Trust Christ. Okay? In your life, you may have some holes now. There may be some issues that you want to be solved. And they're just not being solved. And you may see someone else who appears to have no issues. And that's a lie because all human beings have issues in this life. And they don't bother with it. The Lord has a purpose with the holes and the cracks that you have. Okay? Just trust Him. Don't trust in your own understanding. And don't, don't force healing in your life. Let Holy Spirit do His work, okay? Well, may the grace of Christ Jesus be with you and be blessed you all.